It's unheard of. Attacking Yolkis. Those Ionians must be mad to risk the wrath of Zeus. They are barbarians. How can you be so cold? It's terrible enough what happened. Hera forbid I speak. Your builders are skilled to have world. remade the temple so quickly. And yet, King Jason, how can I express my sorrow? Thank you for your sympathy. My cousin and I were surprised to learn of the friendship between Hercules and yourself. How did you meet? Yolkis is a land sacred to Zeus, Hercules' father. Jason has been kind enough to offer his hospitality as the warden of Zeus when I've come to visit. That's another thing. This warden of Zeus. What does that title mean? All kings of Yolkis who complete the five trials of Zeus assume that title. In doing so, we swear to defend this land and the honor of Zeus against all threats. In some ways, it's a ceremonial title that reflects the strong attachment between Zeus and Yolkis. But what does the Warden do, exactly? I'm sorry. I have some urgent matters to attend to. Perhaps we can speak of my duty some other time. Oh, I see. Of course. You'd have King Lycomedes ask Jason for his temple back. of Olympus, I make to you this vow. I will not see Yolkis again until I have found a way to bring her back. Bless and guide me on the voyage to come. Protect Alcime, and watch over my kingdom until I return. I think now would be a good time. Who's there? Jason. King of Yolkas, Warden of Zeus, I am Apollo. Apollo? Your patron gods support your purpose. I speak for myself and my fellow Olympians, Ares, Athena, and Hermes. A great injustice has been done to you. To murder a bride during her wedding is a crime that defies all virtue. And it was my descendant who was killed. Alcime is a daughter of Ares. She must be avenged. Your purpose is an unusual one. To restore the dead breaks rules both human and divine. Come. Jason, we each would speak to you and grant you our blessings. Approach these statues so that we may speak further. Ares, Lord of Battle, I thank you for your support. Perhaps you can find a way to bring her back. Perhaps not. But there is one thing certain. The Black Tongues will stand against you. The only question a warrior ever need ask is, who is my enemy? Now that you know yours, put your mind to the battle ahead. I'll count every Black Tongue death a worthy And what of your boon, Ares? Have you nothing to offer Jason before his quest? Boons! Unlike you, Athena, the Lord of Battle does not offer gifts. The Lord of Battle 
rewards the worthy. I would think Jason's actions following the murder of his wife would have pleased even you. Against Ionians, ha! Let him fight my own warriors. Then I'll judge his worthiness. Warden, to the west of your palace lies the cave of Amalthea. Long has it been sealed, and with it the challenges that lie inside. Go there if you wish to earn my boon. A warrior who thinks long lives short. Trust your instincts, Warden. Swift Hermes, thank you for your support. Let us speak of the unknown, Jason. Let us speak of death, the greatest unknown there is. Your wife has not been given last rites. I cannot guide her to the underworld. In time, her body will return to the earth, and her spirit will lose its way. If she lingers long enough, she will be lost forever. Then I must hurry. You interest me, Jason. I admire how you embrace the impossible. Should you accomplish what you seek, all the rules will have changed. I will see that you are given a chance. I will watch over Alcime's spirit and protect her body for a time. Let that be my gift to you. Hermes, thank you. It won't last forever, Jason. Remember, sooner or later, all messages must be delivered. Strength wanes. Beauty fades. Only wit grows day by day. Sun God, Apollo. <laughs> 